Hello and welcome back. Uh, I finally got to set up um, <clears throat> where I can do more videos. Uh, the first video I shot, just a preview for Fallout 76, that was from the computer, but I had to change a lot of stuff around because my friends are playing on Xbox. So I had to go through the Xbox app and I had to redo a whole bunch of stuff. And I actually have to play the game on the cloud. Now, this one, the reason I had to set it up is because it takes Xbox first, or it takes Fallout first. That's what it is, Fallout first. Uh, because I'm actually playing in a private world. There can only be eight players on this world, and it's friends only. Uh, my intention is to single play this. Um, I know there are going to be some really, really, really hard fights solo, but... Um, I want to see how it works out. I, I want to play without a bunch of people running around. Now there will be, uh, there will be some videos that are going to be in the world with my friends, which will be all the multiplayer stuff. But, um, I don't really want to do videos and have them in the videos with their names and stuff, unless, you know, it's an event we're doing or something like that. Um, with this, I can play by myself for the most part. Um, and you know, I don't have to worry about anything. The downside is we had to start over. Uh, let me introduce you to, uh, Natasha. Um, basically, I mean, just out of the vault, um, just a little bit of a different hairstyle, same face and everything as the other one, but there we go. Okay. So let's, let's get this, let's get this going. Um. I didn't think there'd be anything there because uh, let's look at the map real quick. There are no circles for other players. Uh, so yeah, you can see we're by ourselves. I'm a little bit nervous about that, but uh, again, it'll be fun too. Um, I just want to do, you know, a, a, a small let's play and get some, you know, get some of this information out for this game. Um, so let's go down. We're going to meet these two ladies again. A vault dweller? Hey there! Whoa, whoa. Just a friend here, not a threat. Just had some questions for you. You came out of the vault, right? I thought it was empty. Wait, is the door still open? Nope. Sorry. <laughs> We got a tip from the Wayward. Heard of the place? New bar down the road. So no, I haven't heard of the place. I just stepped out of a vault. Um, that that sucks, but you know. You know, that's where the big one is. Our last big one? What? What? What big one? You know, you brought everyone back. The treasure. Um. I think you may have gotten some bad information. Told you, Lacey. The guy was scamming us. But those were the last of our caps. No. Someone has to know something. She's a little stubborn. She just don't want to give up. Wonderful. Thanks for answering some questions for us, I suppose. Seems only fair I return the favor. Anything we can answer for you? Uh, sure. Couldn't spare a weapon, could you? Weapon? Be a quick trip trying to do this unarmed. Here. I got a ten mil, but hey. Happy to tell you what I know, which isn't much. Someone made a broadcast not too long back about there being some kind of treasure buried in Appalachia. We don't know what. We don't know where. With people as desperate as they are, it's meant Hang on, I gotta. Just come back to try and see if they can get a piece of it. Check on my dog. One sec. Guy we met at the Wayward. Carter, I think was his name. He gave us a couple of leads to chase down. In exchange for all our money. Up to us now to make something of them. Okay. Well, I better get going. Now, there's two ways we can go. We can go down these stairs here. 
or we can go that way um but first let's go into let's go in here and i'm gonna favorite the pistol and the machete and the rifle i have very little ammo for the rifle but yeah uh let's put that left arm on once we get to a camp and we get some supplies uh we'll be able to make some more stuff okay now let me pull up the perks real quick um let's do that and why i already picked concentrated fire uh and we have two perception there um it's just uh lets me hit limbs and vats My main character is going for a commando build and this one's probably going to go for the commando build also with a slight deviation into sniper. Um, and we're just going to gather what supplies that we can. I learned a lot on my other character playing with my friends. Um, Well, they killed him faster than I could. Okay. Uh, I don't want the spoiled meat, but I will take the hide. Thank you. Um, I should have, um, let me look at settings. Um, is it a game? Um, let's see. I don't see it there. Display, maybe? Yeah, there we go. Okay, dialogue. Dialogue subtitles are on. <clears throat> okay. And I do have my uh, my look speeds for the because I have to play with a controller, so I have my look speeds um, a little bit faster. I may get them. Uh, I may get them even faster. All right, let's rob you guys blind. Looks like they're running a still, is what it looks like to me. Now, these videos are going to be kind of short, probably around the 30 minute mark. Um, I had a lot of success with the 15 minute video so I, I don't know maybe we'll uh we'll we'll just do a number of shorter videos Restore this land of glory. um okay And I'll be honest, I saw a dude this morning go this route uh, and pick up some good supplies. So I decided I would give it a shot. And I want to get wood too. Uh, fallen logs like this can give you wood. You can gather wood from other places, uh, wood piles, things like that. I've been, like I said, I've been learning a lot. Uh, my friends are pretty good teachers. And I will show that character off. Um, she's level 50 now. I made level 50 on her yesterday. Okay, 
Yeah, there it is. these these make sugar you need sugar to make some uh, kims and stuff nothing in there no those will give you way too far off all right something here uh, let's go let's go in here first I'm not real confident with a 10 millimeter pistol, but we'll uh, do we'll do what we can. Okay. Sorry, my dog is scratching. Every time I get on here, the dog's got to make noise. Okay, let's see if we can go up top real quick. First cap, yay. Okay. <clears throat> they like these little wood piles like that, you can get some wood out of them. Whoa. Is that robot good? Is it friendly? What? I did see a farm too. So what we saw must have been Okay, they're friendly. Well, they're neutral at least for now. scrap items like that and it'll give you uh you'll, you'll be able to um um lighten your load a little bit like uh let's see we can scrap that and when you scrap weapons and stuff you have a chance to get uh, uh crafting recipes out of it um uh, girded mm, we'll keep it for now Oh, 
Okay. I may try to put some mines in here too and have uh be able to lay out some mines and do some sniping. That's a screwdriver, can I? Yeah, I'm still adjusting to the uh, controller. It's getting better though, getting better. And like I said, I'm not sure how the single player is going to work on, you know, big stuff. I don't know how that's going to work out, but we'll see. Okay. I don't see what was putting this into caution. It wasn't the Protectrons. Um, not sure what it was. Alright, there is a farm there. Not sure what that is. And we're still headed towards our, our uh, quest. Now this farm is going to have some enemies. I know that for a fact because I was here on, the, on my other character, so... We have to be very careful around those because if they crumble, they let off radiation. Not a good time. There are two enemies right there. Yeah, I didn't think that was going to hit. There we go. Whoa. Whoa, buddy. That was not nice. Figured I was going to miss that. Okay. Now, a good thing about uh, Fallout 76, when you kill something, the bodies glow. And I really do appreciate it. I had to download a mod in Fallout 4 for that. Plus, if they're close enough, you can loot multiple bodies. They have to be close enough, though. I saw him out of the corner of my eye over there. Okay, we have a little Tinker's <clears throat> workbench here. Let's do another scrap. Ah, uh, yeah, 
we don't need those. That's actually not bad. That's in better condition, so we'll we'll tear that one down. Um, we only have six forty-five bullets, though. So I'm gonna keep it for the moment. Okay. One thing you guys won't have to worry about is me saving over and over and over. something up there I don't know what that is but all right now we know there's one on the porch here so we got to be careful Where you going, dude? Or did we actually get him? We got him. Wow. Hello, me impressed. Uh, H E N H N E. I don't know. I never was good at those their little Easter eggs that they put out like that. All right, we're going to clear the house and then we'll loot it. Okay. previous runs there's a cat in here and the scorch there were two scorch trying to kill the cat and they were point blank shooting and couldn't hit it i found it hilarious and the cat was just like i don't give a fuck let's read this note if i can target it there we go uh, okay, real quick. Responders don't know anything. Every night there's more of them in the sky. Brotherhood warned them, warned us all. Defiance has fallen, they said. What the hell's that mean? Supplies are running low. May try to get Abby way over the mountain. Free states have got to know more. Sammy, you read this. Get to Abby straight east of the Red Rocket Mega Stop. She knows the Brotherhood is still better than anyone. May angels look after you because sure as shit, nothing else will. Okay. Uh, Abby's bunker. Okay. Read everything. Um, <clears throat> I mean, you guys know me. I'm all about the lore anyway, so I'm going to read it. But, uh, okay. I think that's anything over here. No. All right. Let's loot the downstairs. Wow, plasma cartridges laying around. All right, then. Let's head on out of here. Our quest is still that way. That's where we're going to go. Now, I'm 
not going to sneak all the way there, but just coming out that door, I want to make sure we don't have anything on us. Okay. Wait, I didn't, didn't go in there and look at that. Oops. Annoyed, angry, exhaling. <laughs> okay, so I annoyed him. All right. I'll buy that. Now he's dead. Try not to breathe too much into the mic. Y'all have to excuse me. Was that the only one in here? I have something else in mind for um I'm, I don't care about a bolt action pistol that one's in better condition so rip that one and you can see I'm getting <clears throat> I'm getting weapon mods when I rip the weapons like that so that's a cool thing all right doesn't appear there was much in here, but every little bit's going to help us starting out. I mean, that's just, uh, that's just how it is. Okay. I did look in that box, right? Yeah. All right. And there's my dog. Okay, let's do a little bit of healing and get rid of that radiation uh, if we got the uh, aid for it. Kind of do. fine on food and water so we'll be okay there we're still headed towards our quest I didn't think I could get any wood off that but uh yeah lots of stuff showing up on the uh the uh compass bar mini map thing down there so And you can start seeing it showing up now. Hello. We'll get those across. Who's this guy? I call them weeds. They're for alchemy and stuff. I call them weeds. I'm going to call them weeds in here too. So when I say weeds, you know what I'm talking about. I'm going to get as many weeds as I can get. Okay.
Now, that's the place that the ladies up there at the vault were talking about. We'll go there in a second. This is my overseer's camp, though, so... I want to we're gonna craft stuff because uh, we have a quest to craft armor and craft a weapon so all right so I'm gonna make uh, the ranger helmet I could make the green the, the tan beret that's pretty cool looking but I think I'm gonna make the helmet first and then we're gonna go into light armor uh, I'm wearing a chest piece we're gonna make a left arm and since we're not level 10, we have to make level 1, so that's fine. Uh, I think I made them all. We'll see in a minute. And then outfits. Okay. Let's exit. Sorry, I got an invite to play. I'm going to have to, um, okay. Where's my, all right. There's my armor Two left. Oh yeah. I forgot. I had a left arm that's in better shape. So left leg, right arm. I need a right leg on the armor, but where is my apparel? I don't see it. Did I actually not make it? So what I say I need a right arm? Right. Right leg. I need a right leg. <clears throat> uh, light armor, right leg. Level one. There we go. Okay. Now, did I not make... Sealed headgear, blah, blah, blah. Airborne diseases, yes. All right. So you guys saw I made that. And then outfits, I want to try to make that. I got the experience for it. Let's put that on. We'll rip that for... Uh, yeah, let's favorite that. There we go. Ranger helmet and outfit. Now we look like a New Vegas Desert Ranger. I know it's kind of cheesy, but I like it. Okay. Now we need to craft a weapon. So... Uh, uh, and it just says craft weapon, so it doesn't matter which one. Um, pipe pistol is 12 damage. The bolt action pistol is 40 because it takes 308, I know. Um, let's just make a pipe revolver level one. And there we go. We're going to exit and let's scrap uh, all our junk. Okay. Uh, let's scrap the combat knife. That's the brand new one I made, so let's scrap that one. And where is the non fa I don't see it. I don't see the non-favorited left leg armor let me go to armor there we go there we go there we go there we go left arm okay that's gonna give us scrap there and we're at 126 of 170 so before any food spoils that we picked up let's see what we can cook uh 
boiled water is going to be useful for sure for cooking. Uh, all food. We're going to make the mole rat chunks before that meat spoils. The meat will spoil in your inventory. Uh, vegetables will spoil. Fruit spoils. Even food that you cook will spoil in your inventory. Glowing resin can make syrup. Uh, why not? Uh, this is rad resist. We may actually need that. So, um, I don't want to cook the corn just yet. <clears throat> I don't know. Maybe we can, um, set up our camp and maybe we can plant some. So I would love to uh, plant an adhesive farm to be honest with you. Um, we need fire caps and snaptail reeds. I know the snaptail reeds that grow on the waterways, the rivers and creeks and stuff. Fire cap, I'm not sure exactly where that's at, but we can, uh, we can find it. Okay, I think we've cooked all the meat that will spoil. Uh, all right, let's go to our stash right here. And we're going to transfer all of our junk first off until I get to our camp and I build a stash box. That's what we're going to do. Um, okay. Um, Let's see. Weapons. Uh, I really should just scrap that. Armor's good. Apparel. Uh, do the glasses give you anything? Like, they give you charisma in the game in Fallout 4. I don't know about here. I don't think they do. I think they just look good. Um, <clears throat> now, this is pretty important stuff here. Now we're going to keep that for now. Antibiotics, myoluminescence, a firefly. Okay. We have two repair kits and two scrap kits on us, but that's okay. We've got the Overseer's Log in Vault 76. We're going to pick the other one up when we do that quest. Um, all right. We can store the note to Sammy for now. And there's our junk our mods I guess it automatically loaded our mods over there I don't know I'm keeping all the ammo except for this one for now we're not going to get a plasma for a while so I'm going to keep the rest of this ammo in case we need it uh, but that gets us down to 95 pounds so that's pretty good and we're sitting at 38 minutes I'm at the overseers camp <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and call it here in the next video we'll go over to the uh, the wayward We'll talk to them. Uh, they, they're going to have a quest. We know they are. And then we'll see about finding a place for our camp and things like that. I know one, my actual camp is right up the road. There was an ore deposit down there that uh, one of my friends is like, you need to put a, a refinery on that or whatever it's called, an ore miner thing, something. I'd have to look it up again. Uh, but my original camp on my other character is straight down this road. And... Um, what I'm planning on doing is just using the town of Flatwoods down there uh, to basically live in and cook and all that good stuff until I get enough materials to actually put down a camp. And I may explore around. Um, it says place your own camp, but I'm not going to get in a hurry for it. I thought you had to be in a hurry, and you don't. Um, so, like I said, I'm going to go ahead and call it here. I want to thank you guys very much for watching. There's going to be a lot more coming. This is going to be a Let's Play. I'm going to try to make it as much a single player let's play as I possibly can. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy it and are enjoying it and will continue to enjoy it and all that good enjoyable shit. So uh, this is Damien and I will catch you in the next one. Goodbye.